In this video, I'm going to show you how to find a drop shipping sourcing agent, a person that you build a relationship with so that they can source your orders, whether it's from China or the US for your Shopify store and ship them extremely quickly to your customers. You can scale with them. They can give you discounts on your products, all the strategies that you can use to find that perfect agent for your business. A lot of people ask me, what do I use to drop ship? What do I use to send products from China? to the US, if we're not using AliExpress or let's say Alibaba, what you do use, even though there's companies that I'm gonna talk about in this video that are great, they're technically agents shipping for you from China to the US, you can also find your own independent agent that's not a company that you pay monthly and they treat you just like every other customer. They treat you very personal on a personal level. They build your business with you. They give you product ideas. One of our students recently scaled up to 20K a month from a product that his agent suggested to him. So I'm gonna show you how to find that type of agent right now. The first place where we start is on AliExpress. We want to search on AliExpress, even though it's not the best place to find suppliers, to find people that are selling products, we can at least reach out to these people on AliExpress and build a relationship with them. So let's say that, let's find a product on the homepage. So let's say that you wanna sell dresses like these or let's see if we can find something else. So let's say you wanna sell coffee machines, for example, you're in the coffee niche and you find this particular product and you wanna sell something like it or products just like it, you can go to the shop that is actually selling this product. So here we have High Brew Official Store. I don't think High Brew is a giant brand. We can also Google them just to make sure that it's not a brand in the US or a brand in any other country. So let's just do High Brew, High Brew Amazon 301. Okay, so they show up on Banggood. It's probably a Chinese brand, but what we can do is we can go and reach out to this particular person or to this particular store called Hybrew Official Store in China. The store has been open since August 29, 2019, so almost two years now. And you can contact them directly here. And you can also, if I take this sales source out, it's almost made half a million dollars. Take this out you can check on the actual seller rating. So this is a great way to start narrowing down who you're gonna reach out to. So you can go to AliExpress, find the product that you wanna sell, in this case, a coffee machine, find multiple suppliers and start reaching out to them depending on the item as described rating, the communication rating, the shipping speed. Now, if you go and reach out to these people and you say, hey, I'm a newbie, I don't have any sales, can you please be my agent? They're going to absolutely ignore you. So if you don't have any sales, you at least wanna have some, maybe five or 10. If you are getting multiple sales, the more sales, the better. If you're getting 20, 30 sales per day, that's perfect, you can reach out to them, tell them that you're getting 30 sales per day, and that if they're willing to actually build an agent relationship. What you can ask them is just, are you willing to build a relationship with me as my agent? I need somebody in China that is my agent to ship my orders to my customers in the US. I'm getting 20 orders per day and I need one as soon as possible. And you'll see a lot of different replies from these different stores. Some of them will ignore you. Some of them will reply, no, I'm not interested. But when you find two to three, this is a great way to find some agents that are already selling on AliExpress. They're gonna build that relationship with you one-on-one -on -one, and they're gonna help you build your business. The same thing applies for Alibaba.com. So these are the first places that I go. AliExpress first, then Alibaba. For example, let's say we wanna go for a coffee machine again. And even though a lot of suppliers overlap from AliExpress, they're also on Alibaba, you'll find some all some new suppliers here. For example, this one, Shenzhen High Up Science and Technology, Shuhai Sunjen Electric Appliances Co. Two years, verified, and ignore the currency. I'm in Ukraine right now. Uh, Shuhai Yungsen Electric Appliances Co. Shuhai Yungsen Elect. Okay, so the same, 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 same. Okay, Unisec electric technologies. These people have been in for four years. So how you analyze all these people on AliExpress, you can go to the name right here. Then you see where they're from. In this case, China, how many years they've been on the platform, the more the better. If they've been there for more than two, three years, that's awesome. Verified, great. And this one, it, it basically measures their performance online. If they have five of those diamonds, that's awesome. If they have one, it's not an indicator that they're a bad supplier, but you wanna be careful with them. So the more diamonds they have, the better. So this one has two diamonds, that's awesome. Let's see if we can find one with multiple diamonds. Or more diamonds than two. These all have two, two, three, three, four. That's awesome. So 13 years in the business. 
It says coffee machine. It is a very expensive coffee machine. They made $480,000 in 33 transactions, but a person like this or a store like this would definitely be a good one to start reaching out to. You can see what they're doing. You can see how many years they've been in the business. You can call them up, you can contact them. And I would definitely create an account on Alibaba, start reaching out to these suppliers that have been in this for more than 10 years. They have on-site inspections, on-site videos. So this is definitely somebody to trust with your products. You can start building a relationship, talk to them. Again, the more orders you have, the easier it is to communicate with them. Just a quick note, I just want to congratulate Jorge from San Francisco for winning our zero to $300,000 case study that I did with my student Johnny. We show the ads, the strategy, everything behind it. If you want to win it, all you got to do is comment down below, whether it's where you're from in the world where you're watching me from or a question that you have about dropshipping or dropshipping agents, make sure to subscribe, hit that notification bell and hit that like button down below and I'll pick a winner from this video. The next step that you can follow is try to look for companies that act as dropshipping agents. They're not one person being your agent with a relationship with you, but they are a company that has a bunch of customers that they're being an agent for. One of those companies, Source and Box, they've been pretty good, even though they had some issues just like every other supplier out there, they're still pretty high quality, their products ship out pretty quickly. And even though it was Chinese New Year, they're still dealing with a lot of orders that now it's doing very well. So definitely a good supplier to trust and to keep in mind. They basically do everything for you. They source the product. If you want a product that you want them to sell, but you can't really find it anywhere, they can source it. They can check if it's a quality product, they can fulfill it and they can also brand your products. The more orders you have, the more ability they have to brand your packages, custom package everything and make it look much better for you. So definitely would recommend to go for a company like this. And there's also other companies like Hyper SKU. It says, one-stop dropshipping solution or eProlo. eProlo is a little bit more hands-on, like you actually need to do a lot of the work for getting those orders and getting those products processed and fulfilled to your customers. But it's also one that you should consider and should look into. So there's many of these suppliers. There's also like Fulfillman, there's Fulfill Panda. There's multiple, multiple suppliers. There's also CJ Dropshipping, which I don't really like too much, but you have many of these options available to you that you can look for to be your agent or maybe your intermediary agent before you find one through AliExpress or Alibaba. One easier way to find an agent that doesn't require you to have too many orders, doesn't require you to have great communication skills is just by hiring someone as your agent. So you can go to upwork.com. They've remodeled their website. It looks really great right now. And you can basically find anybody to work for you in your company. And that includes dropshipping agents. So if you go to search here and you do dropshipping agent and you go to the down section here to China, let's say you want to source from China, you'll find a lot of them that say, for example, $35 per hour, 30,000 earned, 96% job success, top rated, China sourcing agent, dropshipping agent. Boom. If you can find somebody like that, you will need to pay them a little bit extra. The more orders you have, the cheaper it's going to be. Maybe they don't even charge you per hour to work with you. Maybe they just work with you directly. Let's get your order shipped. Let's start working together. We work on commission per product cost and that's how they do it. But a lot of them, if you don't have that many orders, they will require you, hey, pay me 200 bucks to work with me, pay me 500 bucks to work with me. But it is the easy solution. You can check the reviews. For example, this woman here, 20,000 earn, 100% job success. You can go down here and look at the reviews, see if they're legit. So it's very open. If they've done well, you'll see that on the reviews. If they've not done well, they're a bad supplier, you'll see that on the reviews as well. Not like AliExpress where you need to kind of see by yourself if it is a good supplier here, you have it right in your face and you can hire them straight away no BS, just go and hire them. For example, this one, dropshipping agent, China sourcing, fulfillment agent. You can find people like this from Shenzhen, for example, one of the big manufacturing cities, and you can work with them directly right through Upwork and get it started. Another great way to find dropshipping agents that does require a little bit more scanning and filtering by yourself, but you can still do it is by searching on the good old facebook.com and going to groups about dropshipping on Facebook. So for example, if you go to facebook.com, we can go to the search tab and just put dropshipping and then go to the bottom that it says search for dropshipping and find a ton of dropshipping groups. Obviously we have here my main uh, private group that we have all the mentoring students, we have an open group, and then you start seeing all these other, other groups. So for example, we have one open group called seven figure e-commerce secrets. 
And in this one, you can go and post on the main page right here, what's on your mind. You can post, hey, I'm looking for a dropshipping agent. I'm getting 20 to 30 orders per day. Does anybody have an agent that they would recommend? Or is somebody here an agent? The bigger the group, the better it's gonna be. Because for example, if a group has like mine, 20,000 members, compared to one that has maybe 200 members, you're more likely to find an agent here, more likely to find people that have, for example, families in China. We have one student in the mentorship, he has family in China, he can source from China through his family. So it really depends on how big the group is. I recommend you post on 10, 20 groups, as many as possible to try to get the most leads as possible. Or you can just find a guy that's making seven figures that's willing to share his agent with you for a price or for a commission. That would also be great. So definitely a good place to find them. You just go on Facebook, post on many of these groups, get some leads. You will need to do a lot of filtering. Please don't get scammed or please don't trust anybody out of the blue. You will like to find some reviews, maybe that they send you a video of their actual sourcing facility or their warehouse so that you know that it is very legit. The last option that I'm gonna show you here is looking at other social media sites like Reddit, even though it is not the most trustworthy site out there and you could very easily get scammed because of its anonymous nature. There are a lot of groups out there like Reddit e-commerce, Reddit entrepreneur, Reddit dropshipping, Reddit dropship, that you can go and post, create a Reddit account. If you don't know what Reddit is, basically a bunch of communities online. You can post on there that you need a dropshipping agent and get a lot of people interested that will message you or maybe send you a friend request on Facebook, ask for your number and call you and see if they can work with you. You will need to be extremely careful because it's anonymous. So maybe that person that they're saying is an agent is maybe someone in another country that doesn't do anything about sourcing or dropshipping, just wants to scam you. So be extremely careful whenever you're dealing with agents, whenever you're dealing with sourcing people, be extremely careful, ask for reviews, ask for videos, make sure they're legit and make sure that you know that you are using a trusted person. Thank you for watching this video. If you wanna work with me directly and my team to get you results in your Shopify business, whether it's you wanna hit 10K a month, 100K a month, or more, we can definitely help you. All you gotta do is book a free discovery call down in the first link in the description. Talk to us directly, see if it makes sense for us to mentor you, and we build the strategy together to get you results with your Shopify store this year and beyond. Make sure to go in the first link in the description, book your call, and I will see you there. Let's crush it. All right, hope you crush it with the lessons in this video. If you wanna find out a seven figure store secret weapon, I gave out a software that is absolutely insane, getting crazy results for students. If you wanna find out what that is, seven figure stores are only using it. Check it out right here. It's gonna pop up in a square right here, seven figure store secret weapon tool. You gotta check it out. Subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell so YouTube tells you when I upload a video. Hit that like button down below, smash that like button and comment down below for the case study giveaway. I will see you on the next video.